This video is about the Operation Chimera uh, for the ca second campaign mission. I'm going to tell you how to complete all these missions. Uh, so, for example here, uh, it doesn't say the tank. I'm just going to get the tank real quick. Uh, for Union, you have to do Russia and China, right? So, top three by experience earned. Pick whatever tank you think you're best at. Destroy two enemy vehicles during the first four minutes of battle. You probably, and cause 2,000 HP. If you're having trouble with the damage, make sure you do it in the highest tier possible. If you're having trouble with killing quickly, use an autoloader. So with China and Russia, uh, you might have to go with a double-barreled gun on the Russian tech tree. That's probably a good way to do it. Among the top three by experience, that's your choice. 3,000 damage to enemy vehicles. Uh, tier 10 tanks, you definitely want to go with tier 10 tanks. Destroy four enemy vehicles of two different types. Autoloader. Uh, do it in a lower tier if you can. Maybe the, um, the double-barreled Russian tanks would be a good choice. Or a fast light tank, maybe the tier 7 light tank with APCR rounds. You can run around the map and, and blast people. Or you want to do a big gun that does a lot of damage with one shot. With high penetration. Cause damage 12 times to enemy vehicles by shooting them. I would use SPG or autoloader. Fast autoloader. Nothing jumps to mind. I would say SPG is the way to go because you can damage more than one tank with one shot. You can easily damage two or three. Two is easy to do. Three is a little bit more difficult. Do it during the week like Monday through Thursday. Tanks bunch up more often Monday through Thursday. Friday, Saturday, Sunday, uh, they play a little bit smarter. In terms of autoloaders on Russia and China, just the double barrel tanks come to mind. Destroy three enemy vehicles during the first four minutes of battle. You might need an autoloader. You're probably going to need APCR rounds. You could pull it off with an SPG, but uh, not going to be so easy. You're going to need a fast tank to do that, or you're going to need a, a big gun. I've already completed all these missions. Destroy one enemy SPG. Spot and damage one enemy SPG. You need a fast tank. Uh, and if you're going to destroy, use a high pen round with a fast tank. Do it in Tier 7. Damage internal or crew totaling 5. SPG, easy to finish this. HE rounds, anything that's a derp gun that does a lot of damage with HE, this is very easy to do. Uh, the advantage to the SPG is you can pick any tank, so you can go after the lightly armored tanks. 2,000 damage to enemy heavy tanks. Destroy two enemy heavy tanks. Use a heavy tank when you do this. You're going to be playing in the same place. There's lots of heavy tanks where you could do this in four or five shots. You're very likely to destroy two of them. Double barrel guns is a good pick. Uh, the Chinese tier 10 heavy tanks are a smart move. Uh, Object 260 is uh, also a smart move. Destroy two enemy vehicles from 300 or more SPG piece of cake. Or you're going to have to do a TD. Uh, the Chinese TDs, I guess, are okay. Uh, Russian TD with a high penetration round. You probably want to go for the tier 7 just to make it easy. Anything that comes to mind? SPG. I would do it with an SPG. Actually, I did do it with an SPG. Spot four enemy vehicles while remaining unspotted. The T100 LT has a low view range. Uh, I could do it easy, but uh, you want to optimize your light tanks for spotting, not for camouflage, which means recon, situational awareness, call for vengeance. Use the uh, consumables like food, use vents, use coated optics, use uh, binocs, use the directives that increase your spotting range. Check all the tiers. You might be better off in a lower tier if you need to. Stun enemy vehicles for one, you're going to have to do 
an SPG try to hit two or three at the same time. Had a game today where somebody hit five vehicles with one shot, and I did one same game, four vehicles with one shot. So he did like 100 stun damage. I did like 80 in one shot. It is easy. Uh, do it. If you're having trouble, do it Monday through Thursday when tanks are all lemming and bunching up. Destroy six enemy vehicles of two different types. Autoloader is a good choice. Um, do it with a low tier, like a tier 7. Or a high penetration gun. Nothing specific comes to mind. Uh, the, the Russian 103, is it? T-103? Destroy two enemy vehicles having received no prior damage. SPG is easy to do. Uh, you could do it with a light tank. You just run and hide. It's just hiding. We'll pull it off. TD. Cause, receive, and block. A total of 10,000. Uh, object 260. Watch how I do it. It's easy for me to do. I had a game recently where I did 8,000 damage. Blocking. Um, the 113 is good. And maybe the WZ-111. Just look at the turret. Learn how to play hull down. Do it in tier 10. Okay, so that is uh, Union. We're going to move on to Block. This is going to be Germany and Japan. Cause 5,000 to enemy vehicles. I would recommend the, is it the Jagdpanzer E100, the Tier 10? I don't know if I own one, but I've definitely researched it. Maybe I just need to purchase it. That's a big one. Maybe... Anything that's E100, like the E100 heavy tank, might be able to pull it off. The Type 5 heavy with the HE rounds, you could do it, but 5,000 damage with that, it's not a high penetration gun is the problem. Um, maybe the Waffentrager could do it, the Tier 10 Waffentrager. Definitely wait until you get to Tier 10. Skip this until you get to Tier 10. Damage or destroy... Uh, Crew or modules five times, use HE rounds, 2,000 damage. Try to do it in tier 10 with HE rounds. High penetration HE rounds. Uh, the Leopard PTA is a high penetration HE gun uh, that you could pull it off with. Cause 3,000 to enemy vehicles within your view range. Uh, obviously, it's your choice. Wait till you get to tier 10 and it will be easier. Enable to destroy three vehicles that you spotted. Light tanks. The Rheimatol Scorpion is one of the best spotting range vehicles in the game. Uh, so that means in Tier 10, you're going to spot them. It's the easiest to spot. Otherwise, uh, because it's quantity of 3 and not the amount of damage, you can do it in Tier 7. Destroy by ramming. You could either play an, a heavy SPG like the Russian SPGs or the German ones and let somebody ram you. Or get a fast medium tank and uh, practice ramming. Like the E50M is something that people like to ram with. Cause damage 10 times by shooting and spot. Because you have to spot, SPG wouldn't work. SPG will do the damage 10 times, but the spotting, uh, you're probably going to have to use an autoloader or something with a very fast reload. Uh, definitely start with Tier 7. You should be able to pull it off in Tier 7. Or fire HE rounds at everybody. Fast gun, fire HE. Just don't aim for the frontal armor. Hit the sides of the turrets, the side of the tracks, the roof, the rear, etc., Spot two enemy vehicles. So you're probably going to want to do a light tank with a fast firing gun. Uh, does anything come to mind real quick? Um, not sure. Destroy three enemy vehicles remaining unspotted. SPG that's easy to do. Uh, or a TD. Um, the Waffentrager is probably a good choice. You could do this in Tier 7, no problem. So anything that says do a lot of damage, skip all those. Work on the ones where you have to do uh, kill a lot of vehicles. Set an enemy vehicle of the same tier or higher. Easy to do with an SPG. Definitely fire HE rounds, high penetration guns. I would do it in tier 7. Um, Germany and Japan. 
who would be good at Yag Panzer E100 can probably set a lot on fire. Maybe the Leopard PTA because it has a high penetration HE round. You don't want you want HE rounds that do like a hundred penetration. So that's why the Leopard PTA is the right choice for that. Uh block two times more damage and the hit points of your vehicle cost twenty five hundred. You're gonna want to do lower tier vehicle to do the blocking, higher tier to cause damage. Type 4 heavy is a better choice than the type 5 heavy. I forgot the reason why, but they're very similar, and you're going to go up against easier tanks, but going up against lower tier tanks means there's a smaller hit pool of damage to go after. I would say learn to block damage in the type 5 heavy. I've done like 8,000 blocked with a type 5 heavy. It's not hard to do. You just got to learn to do it. You can do this with the Maoshin. You could do it with the mouse. You could pull off all of this with those vehicles. I would say learn to block with the mouse and the Type 5 Heavy. Learn to do damage with those vehicles. Cause 4,000 damage. Wait till you get to Tier 10. At the end, have no injured crew members. So what you got to do for that, bring the large repair kit, the large first aid kit, and maybe bring a small repair kit and make sure when the game's about to end that you do repairs on all your modules and crew. And then you solve that problem. 4,000 damage, just do it in a tier 10 vehicle of your choice. Destroy six enemy vehicles, autoloader, um, high penetration gun, derp gun that does a lot of damage, APCR rounds, gold rounds. Uh, the Jag Panzer E100 would easily do it. Be the top player by damage caused, cost 4,000 damage. You're probably going to want, to want to do this in Tier 10. You don't have to do it in Tier 10. It's just easier to get the 4,000 damage in Tier 10. High penetration rounds like the Jagdpanzer E100 uh, would be a great choice. I don't think the Waffentrager is... I don't have it yet. I've got the Tier 9. The Tier 10, I don't think that those vehicles are high pen like the E100 is. E100, and there's one other vehicle that they've got like 420 penetration, which is crazy high. Destroy six enemy vehicles of two different types. Use some form of an autoloader. Uh, try to do it in Tier 7. Do these before you do the high damage uh, missions. Fast tank helps out. Medium tank. Cause 3,000 to enemy heavy or medium. Use a heavy tank so that you're going to be going up against other heavy tanks. Uh, 3,000 damage, you know, in Tier 10, it's easy to do. When you, when it's all like one class, wait until, like, for example, this week they're doing the Dynasty Wars. Everyone's playing the WZ-111 5A. I'm seeing five or six per game. It's easy to hit lots of heavy tanks during certain periods of time when they do different uh, marathons. Cost 35 to tank destroyers or heavy tanks. You're probably going to want a tank destroyer or heavy tank. Or an SPG, you could easily pick your targets and do it, but save it for tier 10. Okay, Alliance. 25% of the total amount of damage caused by your team. You're going to have to decide that one on your own. Uh, do it in tier 7. Destroy the tracks, three different fire HE. Destroy a track and have your allies cost 250. This, typically you would do it, SPG is easy to do, derp guns. SPG would be easy because SPGs have access to everybody on the map. Stun 10 times, easy to do. Use an SPG, try to hit three with one shot. Cause 2,000 while remaining unspotted. SPG is easy to do. Tank Destroyer, easy to do. Uh, we're talking about... Uh, what vehicle is this? USA, UK, Poland. So, um, the Polish heavy tanks, well, you got to remain unspotted. So, the Sheridan... No, the Sheridan's not good from far away. Uh, the FV215B183, the FV4005, the Badger is another option. 
Um, SPGs, definitely. Destroy by ramming. Uh, I would use a fast medium tank that's got good armor. Uh, the UK tanks are are could are mobile mobile enough. You know what? Do it in tier seven and just go ram everything. Just constantly ram, ram, ram. Stun for one forty seconds. Allies must destroy two. Obviously an SPG. Uh, you can. I, th I guess you can do it. If you're having trouble with it, just do it with a low tier. It's no big deal. Be the top player on your team by damage cause. You're going to have to decide what you're going to do with that. But definitely do something that does a lot of damage or high penetration. Four times more damage than the hit points of your vehicle. Pick a lower tier, like a tier 7, lightly armored um, vehicle, like the Charioteer or the Conway. Or, um, you know, I haven't played the USA TDs in a long time. So really nothing comes to, nothing jumps out. I'm going to lose my place. Yeah, because I don't have one. That's the reason why. Maybe a T30. Okay, so find something with weak armor. Am I doing the wrong way? You know what? I don't even know if we were doing Chimera or not. I really I screwed at this up. Uh, enable your allies to cause 4,000. You want a light tank uh, such as a Sheridan has a great view range. Easy to get 4,000. I can do this in Tier 8. No big deal. Uh, because my tanks are really optimized for spotting. Enable your allies to cause damage to four vehicles by spotting or destroying their tracks. You can do it with an SPG. Uh, you can do it with a light tank easily. Cause damage six times to enemy mediums by shooting them. Play either a TD or a medium. Um, Autoloader, which means... Uh, I, don't, I don't know. Autoloader would be a good choice. Maybe a T-57 Heavy. Um, oh, you know what? Use the 1357 GF. No, that's a French tank. I don't know if the M41 Bulldog has the autoloader anymore. Or if you can get a Tier 7 autoloader with uh, the USA, the T-72. I don't know what tier it is because it didn't exist when I played. Destroy a total of three enemy heavy or medium tanks. Uh, play with a heavy tank or a medium tank. I would say because you got to do the 4,000 damage, do it with tier 10 with a heavy tank so you'll be brawling in the same area. Or play with an SPG. I had a game where I did 5,300 damage with an SPG today. So it's not impossible. Destroy two enemy vehicles from a distance of no more than 100 meters. I would say... Do this with a high penetration heavy tank. Um, just high pen gun heavy tank so you can get close to the enemy or a fast light tank and run around and get behind the enemy. Because you only have to do destroy two, try to do it in tier seven. A T-49 is easy to do it. Um, the UK... Light tanks are clunky. Uh, the M41 Bulldog, I'm not a fan of that. Stun for 160, you're going to play with an SPG. That's easy to do. It's not difficult. Cause 6,500 damage to enemy vehicles. Do it with Tier 10 and uh, find... Whoever has the best gun, FV215B183, FV2005, you could do it with a Badger. You could do it with American heavies, American tank destroyers. Okay, so then the last one is Coalition, which is everybody else. Destroy three enemy heavy or medium tanks. I would do it with a French auto-loading like AMX5100 or... 
uh, but you want to do it because it's three tanks. You want to do it in a lower tier. I would do it with a French light tank to do the medium tanks would be easy. Um, the TVP could easily do it. Destroy tracks of three enemy vehicles. SPG is easy. Derp gun. Damage five times by shooting them. But they have to be immobilized. You want an autoloader to do that. Or you could do it with an SPG and could just look for immobilized vehicles. You know an immobilized vehicle very easily because you'll see their gun move, but the turret doesn't rotate. And their gun will kind of wander around because they're stuck. The French... Uh, 155, 58, tier 10 could easily pull this off. Or maybe an AMX 1357 GF. Be the top player by experience. That's your choice. Cause damage to six different. You want an auto loader and never shoot the same vehicle twice. Destroy an enemy SPG. Enable your allies to call fi cause 1500 by spotting or destroying light tank, definitely. You could also do it with an SPG. I would say, you know, if, you, if you're having trouble, wait until you get to the higher tiers and piece of cake. That's easy. For me, you know, 2,000, 3,000 spotting damage is easy in the lower tiers. For the, I expect to get 4,000 uh, in uh, tier 10. If you have trouble, Rhymatol, Scorpion. No, I'm sorry. Um, Cause damage seven times, same tier or higher by shooting them. Use an autoloader. Destroy an enemy light tank during the first two minutes of battle. Use a light tank and just go blast it and ram it. What would be good? Um, I don't know. Don't know. Finish the battle as top player on your team by experience. That's your choice. Cause 2,000 from a distance of 300 or more. Easy with an SPG tank destroyer. Something that aims well. The STRV could easily pull it off. Um, tier 8. I would do Tier 8 with an STRV. Well, 2,000 makes it more difficult. I would do the Fosh. Uh, the TVP could probably pull it off easily. The Tier 10. Uh, the SPG piece of cake. Destroy 5 enemy vehicles. Autoloader. Try a Tier 7 autoloader, uh, the Progetto, um, TVP, uh, STRV Tier 8, high penetration round. Enable your allies to cause 25 to vehicles spotted by you, cause 2,000 damage. I'm good at spotting, but causing damage with a light tank, I never really did it a lot. I can do it. Uh, so for me, I would say I would do that in Tier 10. Uh, you might need to do this with a medium tank in order to get the penetration, like the TVP. TVP could pull this off. Cause damage 12 times, autoloader. Participate in the capture of a base, cause 2,000 damage, destroy all enemy vehicles. So you're probably going to want a heavy tank and do it on an encounter battle and or assault, you know Assault defend, not so much. But I would say encounter battle, these are easy. And go to the encounter area immediately and just sit there and wait and shoot at everybody that comes out. And it doesn't matter how many capture points you get, but you'll be able to reset easily in encounter battle. In fact, you can get easily 500 hit points of damage just from one of your resets. Destroy six enemy vehicles, autoloader. Damage caused with your assistance or damage caused must be 8,000. This is easy for me with a light tank. I would rack up assistance damage like crazy. Doesn't say stun damage. So SPG, if you track them, you could get some. But I don't know if I could get 8,000 by tracking. You have to go after uh, tanks with a lot of hit points. You could pull it off with an SPG. But I would say a good light tank, uh, tier 10 definitely, high pen rounds, um, TVP is a good choice, get the Binox, 
high pen round, gun laying drive, all that stuff. Get all your directives, and uh, you could pull it off. And if you do this with a friend, you know, get your. This is what you could do. You could get two light tanks. No, I'm sorry. You play the light tank, and you get your friends playing SPGs. They could play any SPG they want. And then you go spot, and they damage tanks that you're spotting, and it's easier to do. But they're only going to get, like, 300 per shot. Uh, but it, you, they could pull it off. You could definitely do this easier if you're doing it with a friend, and uh, you tell them which vehicles you're spotting, etc. Okay, so uh, that is for Chimera. If you have any questions or comments, please post below. Don't forget to follow me on Twitch and subscribe to my YouTube channel.